Diego Garcia in the Indian Ocean. Is this a Guantanamo Bay on British soil? Does the United States hold prisoners from its war on terror without charge in Camp Justice or in ships off the coast? Retired four-star US General Barry McCaffrey says yes. In May 2004, he said, We're probably holding 3,000 people, you know. Bagram Airfield, Diego Garcia, Guantanamo. 16 bases throughout Iraq. In 2006, he let slip again. They're behind bars. We've got them on Diego Garcia. In Bagram, in Guantanamo. The British leased Diego Garcia to the US military back in the 1960s. It's now home to one of the largest US military bases in the world. It's the biggest island in what's known as British Indian Ocean Territory, which means British law, not US law, governs the islands. Even if British officials didn't know about it at one point, at this point they do, we've told them, and since 2004 they've heard it on television. So at this point they would be at least reckless and they would definitely be finding themselves on the wrong end of a lawsuit if they don't act to put a stop to any British complicity in this process. In June 2006, Swiss Senator Dick Marty produced a special report on rendition for the Council of Europe. He concluded that Diego Garcia has been used as a secret prison. Al Jazeera asked the minister in charge of the overseas territories, Meg Munn MP, her response to these serious allegations. She failed to return our calls. Other UK lawmakers are deeply unhappy. It is crucial for Western democracies, led by the United States, we have a clean-up of this. We establish what the facts really were, get it out of the public domain, and say this was wrong. This was a mistake. It was bad, it was unethical, and it was also unefficacious. It almost certainly did not assist us in combating extremism and the so-called war on terror. So repeated attempts by British lawmakers and by Al Jazeera to ascertain whether prisoners are being held or have been held illegally on the island of Diego Garcia have simply failed. Now campaigners are arguing that British members of parliament need to get to Diego Garcia themselves to find out the truth. Mark Seddon, Al Jazeera, London.